What's up guys, welcome to another product feedback video and uh, building on my unboxing of the Apple TV I just wanted to showcase some cool features in which it offers um, to do with the iPad and MacBook Air which I would love to stream across to my Apple TV and it also does work with an iPhone as well uh, which works exactly the same as the way it would work on an iPad. It's pretty cool technology and I just thought I'd showcase you for those interested in purchasing one of these Apple TVs. What's up guys? Um, as promised I was going to showcase how AirPlay functions and the added advantage of using it uh, with your Apple devices. So what I've done is I've installed the Apple AirPlay uh, which is actually down the bottom in the corner there uh, connected into power and then a single HDMI into my TV as well as then uh, hooking it up to my wireless network and the same wireless network in which my MacBook Air, my iPad and iPhone are connected to and that's all I did and the simple, it's very simple actually, I was really surprised just how simple and effective it is as soon as I installed it, I got opened my MacBook Air here and you see this image has uh, popped up in the top corner here it's like a little uh, AirPlay icon and it says here, AirPlay mirroring off and this is Apple TV. And all I did was I clicked on Apple TV and bam, right behind me, the image was mirrored. And the pretty cool thing is, is that the scale of the TV, so 16 by nine ratio, is actually scaled down on the monitor, so reflects exactly what's being displayed on both devices. But it's smart enough to realize that if I'm playing a video, and so I'll go full screen in the video, it actually will start to uh, to play clearly up uh, on the TV in the full scale, so it's pretty intuitive enough. Um, so that's pretty impressive. Um, I did notice though when you would stream full HD videos that it did lag a little bit with the broadcast, but the audio quality and picture quality is pretty decent. Um, it would be nice to control a little bit more on the aspect ratios, but I suppose it's a very easy and simple way that they've set it up. But the next thing is to try it out on the iPad. Okay, so this is the second attempt of AirPlay mirroring. And even on the iPad, it's pretty simple. You didn't even need to do anything spectacular. All you do is you double click the home button, flip across over to the little AirPlay icon here that's now appeared. As long as they're hooked up to the same Wi Fi network, this will appear. And then up the top there, you can go Apple TV and flick on mirroring. And then what happens is. When you actually flick over to your Apple TV, boom, it's actually on there. And it's pretty wicked because, I'll just focus the screen for you. What happens is, is that it's dependent now upon the app. So for example, if I go down to a YouTube app, it actually gives me the option to mirror the video that I'm currently playing, or I can actually just have the video scale to full screen. So I'll show you here and then I'll start playing. But you see how there's those black lines on the side? AFK, you can call it. So it, it didn't take up the full screen, but I believe if I do it this way, it will actually utilize the full screen now on the TV to play back my video. So they've actually embedded it a little bit more intuitively in the iPad, I believe, than in the Apple MacBook Air. But it works really well. Like, I haven't had any issues. It does, like I said, lag a little bit when you're playing full HD video, but it's pretty awesome indeed in terms of the way it operates. Um, apart from really that, is there a Windows alternative to this? It would be pretty cool to find out. Um, I did try playing around with Wi-Di, which is Intel's solution, but it kept freaking out on me with the Samsung uh, TV and a Samsung uh, laptop, or even an LG TV, because they got Wi-Di built in. But that's just, I thought I'd showcase you some of the features and advantages that um, this uh, AirPlay technology can, uh, can offer. Uh, this has been Mohammed with another product feedback video, and uh, peace be with you.